for a new state lottery is far from over, and now Republican Senator Jim McClendon plans to introduce a bill that would allow electronic lottery terminals at state dog tracks. McClendon says his bill would raise $427 million each year, with much of that money going to Medicaid and the education budget. And he also says his plan will rival that of Governor Bentley's lottery bill. The purpose of this bill is to get something to the voters so that they can express themselves and, uh, and make a decision. This legislature will know a direction that we are either going to go or not going to go. Former Alabama Governor Don Siegelman is also weighing in on lottery talks. He says that Alabama needs casinos for a lottery to work, and CBS 42 is tracking all the developments for a lottery push. Of course, we'll bring you the latest on air and online.